हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू आर यूट्यूब चैनल अप्लाइड फॉरेंसिक रिसर्च साइंसेस आई एम रवि अग्रवाल प्रेजेंटिंग द टॉपिक न्यू एडवांसमेंट टेक्नोलॉजी इन फॉरेंसिक साइंस पार्ट टू दिस वीडियो इज रिटन बाय युक्ता गुगलोत सेक्रेटरीट अप्लाइड फॉरेंसिक रिसर्च साइंसेस एंड प्रेजेंटेड बाय रवि अग्रवाल वॉलेंटियर ऑफ अप्लाइड फॉरेंसिक रिसर्च साइंसेस सो इन दिस वीडियो वी विल टॉक अबाउट द टू न्यू एंड एडवांस टेक्नोलॉजी ऑफ फॉरेंसिक साइंस यूज फॉर एनालिसिस ऑफ फॉरेंसिक सैम्पल्स फर्स्ट वन इज एल ए आई सी पी एम एस लेजर एवलेशन इंडक्टिवली कपल्ड प्लाज्मा मास स्पेक्ट्रोस्मेट्री एंड द सेकेंड वन इज वाई एस टी आर वाई क्रोमोजोम शॉर्ट टेंडम रिपीट सो लेट्स स्टार्ट विद अवर फर्स्ट टॉपिक एल ए आई सी पी एम एस लेजर एवलेशन इंडक्टिवली कपल्ड प्लाज्मा मास स्पेक्ट्रोमेट्री दिस इज बेसिकली थ्री डिफरेंट टेक्नोलॉजीज यूज फॉर एनालिसिस ऑफ सॉलिड सैम्पल्स इट इज़ अ पावरफुल एनालिटिकल टेक्नोलॉजी that enables highly sensitive elemental and isotopic analysis to be performed directly on the solid samples this technology was invented in 1980 by sir alan gray la icp ms begins with a laser beam focused on a sample surface to generate fine particle a process known for laser abrasion the ablated particles are then transported to the secondary excitation source of icp ms instrument for digestion and ionization of sampled mass the excited ions in the plasma torch are subsequently introduced to a mass spectrometer detector for both elemental and isotopic analysis this technique is fast reliable precise and environmental friendly advantages of la icp ms la icp ms is one of the most existing analytical technologies available because it can perform ultra highly sensitive chemical analysis down to part per billion level without any sample preparation samples can be both conducting or non conducting and the analysis can be performed in the air without the need of complex vacuum system therefore results are available within seconds this technology delivers that fastest analysis speed of all analytical technique with the limit of detection approaching part per billion level note The two most commonly used laser based method are bulk analysis with a typical laser spot size of 100 to 300 micron and micro analysis with a laser spot size as small as few micron. LA ICP MS allows versatile solid sampling scheme that include bulk analysis, local inclusion and defect analysis, depth profiling, elemental and isotope mapping. Due to fast and reliable results LA ICP MS technology used in various foreign laboratories now moving on to our next topic why str introduction why str is abbreviated as y chromosome short tandem repeats it was invented by dr peter d neff with professor lutz rover and professor manford kaiser y chromosome have been used in forensic investigation since 1990 when the first case was reported in germany Y chromosome short tandem repeat method is applied in the case of male on female sexual assault in which the victim's DNA is in the great excess and marks the male contribution because of the presence of Y chromosome in male DNA Y short tandem repeat analysis is able to detect the presence of very little amount of male DNA in one or multiple donor and resulting the genetic profile can be compared to the non reference samples so the str markers are located in y chromosome and the y chromosome haplotype reference database are used to analyze and interpret the dna evidence in sexual assault investigation benefits of y str first is helpful in case where there is an excess of dna from a female victim and only a low proportion from a male second is helpful in the detecting male dna under the fingernail of a female victim third is helps in detecting male touch dna on the skin and the clothing belonging to the female victim this technology is reliable and give the accurate result that's why some of foreign countries are using this technology for the identification of male accused in the case of crime against women This technology was also used for detecting one or more number of male involved in a similar crime. Thank you for watching the video. 
If you have any query relating these topics or video, please visit the comment box. If you find the video interesting and informative, then share with your friends and like the video and subscribe our channel Applied Forensic Research Sciences. Thank you.